All right, everybody, welcome back to another vlog. Today's uh, March 1st, 2018. Uh, today's been a fucking great ass day. We already worked out, uh, meditated, haven't read. We already wrote, um, haven't studied or learned anything yet today, but I mean, the day's still young. It's only 2.22 right now. And uh, we just picked up, uh, picked up a 40 sack, flipped a little bit of our sack. Already, already said about the workout, already did the meditation. Um, so now we're about to go home, about to go eat. Um, eat, drink, and then we're going to smoke, and then we're going to figure out the rest of the day. Uh, probably should do the rest of our daily responsibilities, our daily routine, and daily discipline schedule. Create the day that you want to have. Um, it's your time. It's your money. It's. Uh, we did our accounting as well today. Figured out that we're about $11,500 in debt, which, I mean, it could be worse. But I'm thankful that I did the accounting. I did what is necessary, the bare essentials. And I found out also that I owe at least like $1,000 today to pay for all my um, my bills, my debts, and my responsibilities, and my student loans, and credit cards, and um, anything else like that. I um, also want to pay off like to my, to my parents and uh, my family. And then also, I don't really have any friends, but... If I did, I'd want to pay them. Well, I used to have friend like I want to pay back like Cody Dieters. He paid for like one of my concert tickets, and um, there's other people that I want to like. If it was like if I had the money, I would pay them back, and I really feel like that that is true. And I also feel like I need to create my story. I want to write the letters to everyone, and I really think that I need to plan for uh, my death day being March 9th, my court date. Uh, I looked online. And it's looking like we're probably estimating around like a $400 fine for the possession and paraphernalia charge, which is fucking fine. I mean, it's better than fucking jail time. Or maybe not. Like, maybe I should just, maybe I should take jail time and then use that time to sort out my life, sort out my things. And I really think, like, I really have a problem with this fucking court date. And I think that these next nine days I'm going to prepare, prepare so I'm not fucking scared. Like, truth or dare. I want to encourage myself to declare war. Like, I, I don't believe in this money that we have. I don't believe in, in God we trust. It should be changed to in, in us we trust. And I think that I'm going to be the future president of the United States. At 35 or 2031, I'm running for fucking office. I'm going to change this fucking world if it's the last thing I do. I'm going to fucking die trying. Like, I I think I can make it a better place, a better, yeah, a better place with my ideas and my implementation. And I think that cops and government and the whole politics thing is just it's corrupt it's wrong it's it's not freedom man like it's not fucking freedom and i also need to get the fuck out of this state i was thinking about this yesterday i do know better so i know that i should not be in this fucking state because i cannot smoke weed here so i need to get at least to colorado or california probably both but if you know better, do better. And that's another thing that I've noticed is if you think about it, if you know, if you think and you know, then you like do better. And it's really that fucking simple because I came across the same situation when I tried going back to college for a little bit. I was, I was trying to find a house and I knew that I didn't want fucking roommates because I knew that they would fucking steal from me or fuck me over or like whatever like whatever like I knew better and I should have done better and I feel like there was a hindrance on maybe on like I know I need to take more responsibility for my own actions but that doesn't discredit other people's actions too like other people affect me what other people do does affect me and I think that it's wrong to only take all the blame and I feel like I've been doing that all my life there is there is a time and place to blame others because, like, if you have done everything fucking perfect, and something happens, or life fucking happens, then maybe there is a time and place to blame someone else. But I also think that there is a time and place to accept all the responsibility for yourself, for your actions, for what happens to you in your life. I knew that I should not be in this state, and what ended up happening, I ended up getting catching two charges. Like, I caught two fucking L's. And... We have that court date, so maybe she, like, we can talk about that more, but I just wanted to vlog real quick. Thank you guys for watching. It's been another vlog. Deuces.